I think I'm going to miss the most about the people. Um, Sanford is just home, and so it's like bittersweet as I'm excited to take this new step, but I'm so sad that you know I don't get to walk on campus and see this beautiful campus every day and see the professors and the people that really have just become my community and have had such an impact on me. The people and the experiences that I've just had throughout the four years has just been incredible. Um, and not everyone's leaving, but some are, and that's just kind of sad. Um, I've definitely made a tremendous change. Um, my relationship with God has grown a tremendous amount. Um, just my friends and just be able to meet all these different people that, that have had an impact on my life, from my professors, a lot of people to feed into my life, just make me a better person. This is what they've been waiting for. It's all the hard work, the late nights, the grind, it's all to get a degree from Sanford University. It was hard work, um, but I'm so happy that I made it and I'm done, so I'm excited. It's definitely challenging, but I learned a lot. The professors were very, very helpful um, and it helped you in any way that they could. It felt like a family too, and everyone was very encouraging and challenged you. Sanford does an amazing job um, about preparing their students for real world scenarios and really preparing them for challenges that they might face and developing perseverance within their students as they do that. In-person commencement is back, a throwback for most, as outdoor ceremonies make a return in 2021. No matter inside or out, the feelings for this place remain the same. I'm definitely going to miss the community that Sanford offers. You know, it's a tight-knit community where everyone's got each other's back. We're all helping each other learn and grow along the way. This place is, is a, it means a lot to me because this is a good school and the teachers are, are, are good teachers and they everybody's willing to help. It was an incredible community just throughout the four years, just starting freshman year um, till now. It's just a, so, such a small community. You get to meet so many people. Um, and the friends you have will just last, last a lifetime. If there's one thing that I feel that I've been, it's empowered. Um, I definitely feel that I've been empowered to just go out and really achieve anything that I want to. Um, I definitely think that I have the foundation from the classes I've had or the experiences and the opportunities that no matter what I want to do in life, that I'll be able to be prepared to take that next step and accomplish just that. 2021 commencement. Dr. Westmoreland's last as Sanford's president, but he leaves this class like so many before it full of joy, full of hope. I want you to know that I am undeserving of the kindness you have given so freely during the years we have shared. And when this ceremony ends and you've said your final goodbyes, a new covenant will exist between you and Sanford because for all time to come, this will be your alma mater. And wherever you go and whatever you do, you'll carry our cherished hopes and dreams just as you carry your own. And for decades to come, those you leave behind will cheer from this Alabama hillside as each day you engage your mind, your hands, and your soul in all that you think, say, and do. And we will say, from hearts brimming with gratitude, that was my student. Congratulations, class of 2021. Our hopes, our prayers are forever with you.